What's going on people? Welcome back to Chelsea Fan TV. Welcome back to another match day vlog. And it's the last home game under 100% capacity. Obviously, unless things change, some sanctions have been um, weakened over the last few days. We are being allowed to make a bit more money per match day, which should be able to keep the stadium flowing on home games. But it's still a very uncertain situation right now. Again, smash the like and subscribe button to Chelsea Fan TV on your way here. And it's Chelsea versus Newcastle and... How the tables have turned for both teams is now Newcastle, that's the rich club, and now we're the club with literally nothing to spend right now. Couldn't have predicted it, but here we are in it. We just have to deal with the situation as it comes. Like, I do feel confident that regardless of what happens, we should be fine until the end of the season. The government aren't going to let Chelsea go bust because they do need to sell it, and they do need it to be at a maximum value. So I'm not necessarily worried about the future of the club in the short term, but I'm worried about the impact that will have on the players. Like Norwich were excellent in the first half, but we were absolutely poor in the second half. And we still haven't really dominated the full game from the first minute to the 90th in a while now. I think the last time was in the Tottenham game. So we do need to see a stronger performance. And we're facing a good Newcastle side too. Unbeaten the league since the 19th of December. Not any results against any top tier teams, unless one of you guys can remind me in the comment section below. But they're in confident form and they're definitely going to be more confident in a better mood coming to this game than we are. So we need to turn up in this game. Already, like, there's enough issues around Chelsea right now without us making um, top four even harder for us because Arsenal are just breathing behind our necks. Manchester United just got a win against Tottenham as well. We need to keep the same energy flowing. So we're going to head down to the ground. I don't know what atmosphere it's going to be. I don't know what to expect, but let's just hope for three points. Take care and up the gels. Distribution out the back hasn't been great either. Start this game so slowly. Let's hope we get back to it. Yeah. 
another one. Oh, oh my gosh. That was close. That was too close. He's coming for you! Boris Johnson! He's coming for you! He's coming for you! He's coming for you! Right, half time, still nil nil. Not really been a lot of attacking play from us. Like Dan Burns has been clearing everything, but we haven't been at the races. Distribution hasn't been too great. Been good progressively, but have lacked a lot of killer instinct in the final third. Most chances have come from corners. Haven't really had a chance to whip anything in. It's been a bit of a lethargic first half. Good save from Mendy towards the end of the first half, but again, there's not really been anything. There's not really been a lot to speak about. We haven't really looked all there. Maybe it changes in the second half. I don't know, but like, it's not been the most inspiring of first halves. See what happens in the second, innit? Do anything with the passes. His touches ain't been there.
Oh! oh.